Up y'all, it's your boy DJ Killzone Jones. Remember the name. I'm just kicking back, man. But yo, my top three albums for this year. J. Cole, 2014, Forest Hills Drive, Big Crick, Catalactica, and Tef Poe, Cheer for the Villain. And uh, that's in no particular order. I'm going to go ahead and start with uh, Big Crit. Man, Big Crit, man, that album, I was waiting on Catalactica since he announced it last year. He had the song done last year, the, the teaser done last year. I love the teaser uh for the for the uh for the video. It didn't end up not being the final video, but just the teaser video was real dope. Him driving the Cadillac at like full speed and then, you know, then you know what I'm saying, we we start getting the singles and at first I didn't like pay attention, but as I the song kind of grew up on me, you know, he got a uh, Rico Love on that joint, you know what I'm saying, and uh you know, uh, that was a smooth joint. And then, you know, Cadillac, the, good, the lead single was off the chain. And then uh, Soul Food was a dope single. And then the rest of the song just kind of like from beginning to end, I found myself not skipping a song. Um, You know what I'm saying? Uh, And just the production on this, you know, the, the lyrical content. Everything, you know, Crit uh, always comes with a, with a dope album. And, you know, this one I just, I couldn't skip. I couldn't, you know, move, you know, move the knob away. And I've been, I've been listening to Crit, man, since uh, See Me On Top, number one. Uh, I wasn't really a big, big fan. Like, I had heard See Me On Top when I was on, on, on that piff. And I heard the album, but I just, I didn't pay attention to who the dude was or whatever. And, you know what I'm saying, just to see his progression, you know what I'm saying? Because I came back uh, doing Crit Was Here, and then I went back and listened to all the other mixtapes before Crit, Crit Was Here. Then I listened to Crit Was Here, and then I was I was banging Crit, Crit Was Here. And then, you know, he came out with Awful and Life of the Underground and uh, 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 Shoot Forever in a Day, uh, Return for Forever, and you know what I'm saying? And then, you know. Uh, the K.R.I.T., you know, the, the, the self-titled album. And then he got to this one, and it, it's just it's everything a Crit fan been waiting for. Um, If you like Crit, if you like good music, if you like, you know, rappers talking about something, Crit is your guy. Uh, Next person we're going to talk about is uh J. Cole, 2014, Forest Hills Drive. Um, This album came out, no singles, no videos. You just, you know what I'm saying, you just uh, got a freestyle. And then when you heard the album, the album was dope. You know what I'm saying? Um, it, it it was real, real dope. It really hit the pulse of what's going on. You know what I'm saying out here uh, today, as far as you know, social commentary. It was a very, very interpersonal album. I would say even more so. You you thought you would think that you know J Cole don't have no, you wouldn't have no more stories from the warm up and in Friday Night Lights and. In, in in the first two albums, Cold World and, Bo, uh, and, and and Born Center, but he got so much, you know, so much left to tell and so much left to say and so much on his heart and mind and you know what I'm saying from 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 friends, you know, encourage him to keep going on on the straight and narrow path to you know what I'm saying getting something from the first time and losing the love of his life and um you know what I'm saying looking out for his family and and, and everything else. Um, it's just it's the it's the human experience, you know what I'm saying? It's it's the black man experience, you know what I'm saying? Put on the CD, and it was real dope. Um, Tef Poulter for the villain man. This this album came out in what January, February, and you know what I'm saying? I I know Tef Poe personally, you know what I'm saying? Um, real down to earth dude. He put out he pretty much put this out the soundtrack for a year, you know what I'm saying? If it, as far as uh, you know what's going on in our city, uh, what's going on in in the mind of Tef Poe, You know what I'm saying, and, and, and on the heart of Tef Poe. Tef Poe always has been a man for the people. Um, and this album, you know what I'm saying, was supposed to come out on Universal Records, but they didn't want it because of the message, because of what it, it it stood for. You know what I'm saying. They didn't want to really push the album and 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 and, and promote it. 
they didn't want to put it out because they felt like it would not be commercially successful. Um, and I'm here to say, you know, it was, you know what I'm saying? I bought two copies of it, you know, um, I bought a physical and a digital copy of it, you know what I'm saying? And I really, I feel like just like these other two albums that these albums personify, you know what I'm saying? Like this album right here personifies, uh, you know, the human experience, the St. Louis experience, you know what I'm saying? It personifies, you know, the, uh, the disconnect between the, 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 the people and you know what I'm saying the the lawmakers and, and the judicial system it, it personifies the then the life of 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 of, a, of young men in the streets and the in the very little choices that they have you know what I'm saying or you know the 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 very the lack of time of decision making that they have I would rather say that and it tells the score the story of uh the life. And you know, unfortunate demise of his cousin. Um, and it's a very, very, very it's a long album. It's longer than both of these other albums, but it is a con it's a true concept album. Uh same way Catalactic is, same way as 2014 Forest Hills Drive is. And I just feel like y'all, if y'all don't know who Tell Poe is, y'all need to check it out. If y'all don't know who Big Crit is. Y'all better check it out. And everybody and their mama should know who J. Cole is. You know what I'm saying? But if you don't know who J. Cole is, check out his music. Check out the all three of these albums. These are my top three right here, man. Um, and I'm out, y'all. Um, uh, make sure y'all like, comment, favorite, you know, subscribe if you haven't. Thank you if you have yet. Yeah, let me know y'all, y'all top three or top five albums. These ain't like I say, ain't no particular order, and there are more. I just wanted to pick three. Because I felt like if I pick five, I'm gonna pick more. But I pick I narrowed my list down to three because I feel like, you know what I'm saying, that's what you get first, second, and third place. And this one, all these dudes is first place. You know what I'm saying? There's no there's no order, there's no, you know, whatever. And um y'all should go pick up these albums, purchase these albums, support these artists, get you know, put them put some money in their pocket, you know what I'm saying? And I'm out, peace.